Welcome back to Project Onboard. It's Warren here, and today we are kicking off right where we left off. So it's been been a night. We're back on the weight gain. I drank a fair amount of bourbon. We've got a whole bunch of white wine and red wine left, and just a decent amount of food. So I'm actually going to kick the day off with some canned tuna. Nice. Leave the tinnies behind, and let's get to it. So. What I found at the end of last episode was this little beauty just here. So in this shed, we've got a generator. Between us and that generator is countless amounts of zeds that I am not prepared for in the slightest. Like, not even close. So yeah, today is going to be fun. Very, very fun. We've got a lot of zeds to deal with and some crops that need tending to. So not a ton of time to do it. So yeah, without further ado, let's get straight on it. So I'm hoping, big hopes, that... Okay, maybe not. <laughs> I was going to say, the Zeds hopefully had some time to disperse and disappear and do their own thing. But yeah, it's not looking promising at all. Did I bring the other axe with me? Or have I just got two hand axes, three hand axes, and a pickaxe? Yeah. It's not bad, not a bad mix, especially not at the level we're at. Yeah, almost level 7. Is this the quickest we've ever almost maxed out axe? It's gotta be. God, look at him go. He's a machine. A well-oiled one too. Thanks, friend. Alright, what we do also need to do is definitely definitely keep on top of our stamina so if we start dropping we're gonna start dropping very quickly we're still not quite at a weight cap that i'd like to be at so yeah we need to sort of balance between an axe and a hunting knife as much as possible just to keep him at his a game from start to finish I think we got this. I'm not too stressed. As long as you guys aren't stressed, I'm not stressed. Sweet airs. Alright, let's keep pumping through. Probably head up this way and round, so I think I dragged a ton of them down here, so hopefully we avoid them. So I'm kind of kind of wanting to do as little work today as possible. That would be nice. Well, Z work anyway. So I would like to bring as many as many out into the open as possible and just leave them behind. So yeah, that's always always a good way to be. Sweet airs. Let's keep pushing up. I think after our discovery of the mess that's around here, it's probably a good idea to head around the outside. Looks like there's a clearing too, which is a bit of a result. So I'm kind of struggling to keep this weight down at the minute too. <laughs> Not ideal. But yeah, already on the hunting knife too. So if I can balance it out on the quiet groups, we should be fine for the big groups. Speaking of big groups, this group just kept growing. <laughs> and there it is. Okay, time to get inside. Get out of here. Guess now's the perfect time. Oh. There we go. That's the stab I was looking for. Get there in the end. Do you reckon that place is safe? Or are we just gonna keep on keeping on? I reckon we keep on keeping on. So it looks kinda safe. But I know for a fact there's going to be a hell of a group waiting for us. And that is not what I want to deal with. You, however, kind of are. But you went down in one decent kick. Too easy. Let's keep on. Keep on trucking. A couple to take care of. Nothing too crazy. Come on, fellas. Come and get me. I'm ready for you. Wait to level this knife up. 
don't know if you remember my uh, road to Louisville. Yeah, back when Louisville was first released. The knife run on that was just something else. So that Rambo blade was just out of this world. It really was. So I've got no no comparison to it at all. That thing was just a machine. Ooh, you got a bag. We're close to. I think that's the building. That's the building we want to be in. Come on, fellas. So it'd be nice if I can get in there and rest up before trying to run home. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Might just take that bag off him. Hopefully he's got some peanuts or something. Nah, nothing. At least it hopefully won't despawn there. I'm not too sure how bags work, but I think it's like that. 603. Big group. Not what I wanted at all. Don't think that's the house either. Come on fellas, let's get this over with. I wish I bought the big axe. Get out of here. Don't know why old grey jumper won't go down. God, I even throw a big swing. There we go. Nice. Oh, there was a hunting knife, wasn't there? Would like that hunting knife. Sweet ass. Ooh. What are we playing? A letter opener today. No need for bread knife or machete. Is this? Is this Kate and Bold Spot's house? Ah, oh, there's a house alarm. We gotta go. We gotta go fast. We're just about here in the distance down here somewhere. That's not something I want to deal with today. Or ever. <laughs> not when I want a nice quiet day. Ah, crap. Yeah, we might have, might have done a while earlier. Ah, uh, there's no point even sneak sprinting. Let's just, let's do this properly. Because I'm going to get hurt. Real bad. Sneak sprint. All the way back to where we started. Nice. Alright, I'm going to wait for that to clear up. Probably spend the night and have some good wine. And then, yeah, see you bright and early. Don't know if I've got any books to read in the meantime, but... I'm sure he can keep himself entertained somehow. Maybe even a carpentry book. Eh, uh, not quite. Oh well. Alright, I'll see you guys in the morning. We're really starting to rack up a booze collection down there. It's a bit of a problem. <laughs> Thank god he can't gain an alcoholism trait, because he would be screwed. Alright, can we get any water from anywhere? That'll do me. And we'll fill up those two as well. Nice. Alright, let's grab probably some canned tomato or something. Fruit cocktail. Nice. Spruce it up. Tasty. Cool. Hopefully, I'm really, really banking on it being dead quiet out here today. Because I really want that generator. Really want it. I'm getting, getting quite itchy. Not off to a good start already. Let's get the old short blunt in there. I thought they were going to go down a hell of a lot quicker. <laughs> One, two, and three. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. How are we looking? No, I'm hoping I didn't draw too many down this way. Looks like most of them drifted off, which is nice. So it might just be worth heading up the main road or something. We've lost most of them. Could you imagine? It'd be like a dream come true. And I'd have done zero work. Apart from just run away. <laughs> All of that just to sprint off. Ah, it's the group. At least one group. Yeah. Um. Looks like a small group though. What do you reckon? Smash our way through. Yeah. 
is not liking that. He's a little bit too scared. A little bit too scared. Ah, the jump scare's getting as well. Uh, uh, uh. There we go. Order has been restored. And a cheeky start to finish it off. Alright, here's hoping. The main road is empty. Get out of here. Neither of you were invited. This was a closed party. Okay, it's not too bad. It's definitely quite bad. Definitely should not have come this way. At all. But... It could be worse. Definitely seen worse. Very recently. I'm going to back up into a big group here, and it's going to get messy. So it might be worth just... I mean, I reckon we take care of these anyway. Should we speed it up a bit? Yeah, let's get a time lapse on. Screw it. Alright, there's definitely something going on with the exhaustion from these axes, because swinging these things is just taken out of us like there's no tomorrow. So I mean, I get it's a lot of zeds to kill, but at the same time, it feels a bit... nope. feels a bit drastic compared to how it used to be. Am I the only one seeing that? Was there something changed that I've missed? Probably. I tend to just ignore a lot of things. Would not be surprised. Party like a rat house party. No generator. Shame. Ah, this is a cookbook. Um, do we rest in here? Successfully too. Let's grab what booze we can. Rotten pork chop, plenty of tinned food. Come to Papa. My back's full. How? Ah, we got all the broken stuff with us. Makes so much sense. Can have a big tin, at least. Get ourselves a little bit of weight back. Anything in here? No. I'm guessing that bowl of cereal is rotten as well. Bowl of stew. And yes it is. Okay, that's the shed we need to get to. And how are we going to do it is the question. Painfully. I think we might have to go through this group, at the very least. Let's have one more beta blocker. Set ourselves up properly. So we're well fed. Well, fed enough. We're just overweight. Can we make ourselves underweight? Maybe... You in the bag, or you? No, no we can't. We are overweight. It's just something I've got to deal with. At least we're not exhausted. It's the little things. <laughs> ah, crap. Okay, back to the drawing on board. Back to the short blunt dream. Us. So I do really need to level this up. What level are we actually? Short blunt? Level 3. Not bad. Oh, if we can just sort of tuck it around here, we'll be fine. This uh, house is actually fairly secure. Quite surprised. So we've done well covering this general area. Well, down to the factory, really. Everywhere up from that is it's a bit of a dream. E, one down. Just hoping that'll be two. 
and we're going to make it free. That's the last. Beautiful. All right, the question is, are we going to be able to get through this garden without seeing a Z? And are we going to be able to get it home without seeing a Z? That's, that's the second part of the fight. Wonderful. Well, there's a, uh, there's fun over. The war has begun. Come on, then, fellas. We can smash you guys out very, very quickly, preferably. Life will be good. Life is good. Same again for you. I'm gonna have three coming behind me any minute. Getting kinda scared. And the exhaustion catches up. Easy does it there, boy. Sweet ass. Uh, how's that looking? I think that's actually all of them. Oh, maybe not. Nice. Is there a lighter? There is indeed. It's a double bagger. Not only a generator, but a bastard lighter too. Nice. Alright, anything in these? Metal bar, trowel, crowbar. Pretty good stuff. I hate that that comes with that. <laughs> it's the one mod we have. Alright, here we go. We've got to get as far as the diner. That's, that's the goal. If I can make it there and just settle until our... Uh, till... Ooh, I don't like that sound. No, for good reason too. I'm going to need to rest. Yeah, definitely going to need to rest. You are the three that I was waiting for though, so that's always a good sign. Nice. I wonder if there's anything at all in the kitchen. Nothing in there. Still in the hunt for an electrical book. If anyone spots one before me, please let me know. A terrible, terrible eyesight at the moment. <laughs> I mean, I can see perfectly fine. I'm just blind as a bat. Let's grab both of you. I might even take those chickpeas. Yeah, it's going to make us very, very overweight, but it's all worth it. All worth it somewhere. Yeah, definitely worth it. Come on, generator. Let's do this. Hopefully we can make it back in one piece. Hopefully not one scratched piece. Okay, yep. Yeah. This trip is going to be painful. I don't know how we're going to get through the woods. <laughs> That's the even scarier part. I haven't even made it there yet. Come on. Break it up a little bit. There we go. Smooth sailing from here on out. It's open. Here is hoping. So I reckon stay here for the night. Got one very close behind me. Stay here for the night. Probably not a bad idea. Get ourselves well rested. Probably smash out another bottle of wine. Maybe some beers. Just, yeah, take a day. Recuperate. Head through the woods in the morning. Because that's... That's going to be the kicker. So I'm honestly very, very scared for it. But... Yeah, you can only do so much, can't you? Let's have a smoke and get some sleep. I'll see you guys bright and early. Got a nice little rainy day today. I'm going to head down, have a little scout. That's a very good good thing I did. Let's clear out what we can and then hide tail through the woods. So I'm still terrified. That good night's sleep did not help us at all. So I mean, sorted our character out, but that's not reduced my fear by any means at all which is yeah, not ideal but it's got to be done we got to get a freezer home it's actually going to be our next mission isn't it 
Get in a freezer home. I wonder where we can even find one. Probably a gas station. Yeah, there's probably one up there actually. It's a good shout. Okay, I'm gonna miss the generator. Let's do this. There was a key down there that we need to grab as well. So I'm like three days late to a comment. But there is a key. I think it's down the other end. Yeah. Pretty sure it's down the other end. Alright, let's see what we got. Hopefully. Big hopes. We're all good. Do you know what? I'm gonna walk the last bit. Just in case. See those shaky trees? I ain't playing no games. Are we good? Pretty good. Last few stragglers as we make it out. Wonderful. Any more for any more? One. Ah, two. Get out of here. See ya. Now we're looking for axe skill. Halfway through level 7. What was then? Level 10 by episode 20? <laughs> Not even. Probably like 15. So it would be nice to get that to level 5 by episode 20. That could be a good goal. Alright, let's do this. Come on, Pete. Be the man I know you are. No, I might have done a silly sprint in the whole way. Might have done a silly. Screw it. Let's drop it while we can. The second I get too exhausted, that's when it's a problem. How about you, Greeny? How are you? Fancy an axe to the face? No, you don't. Axe to the back of the head it is. It's always one. Might just take care of these two. Hey up. How are you? Dead. Nice. It was a pleasure. And sorry my dear, but you've got to meet the same fate, unfortunately. There she goes. Come oh, man. You're just coming along for the journey, aren't you? Don't want to leave your friends behind. I get it. Fortunately, I'm the only man that can help you. <laughs> it was so close. So close. I don't know if we picked up. Picked up two. Okay. We might just be a little bit further away. Hopefully we don't have to do a little wild run. Nah, we're good. We're good. We got this. Don't know what that would you old Pete. It's just a tank, innit? It's just a tank. And we're quiet. Nice. Time to get rested. Finally. And have a cheeky smoke. Let's get them both done. What a sight. Alright, let's have a little look at our plants. See how they're getting on. Looks like... Ah, oh, that's a bush next to it. What are you up to? Get out of here. You ain't no potato lover. Oh, they're ready for harvest. Okay, we need to act fast. Incredibly fast. Um, we need... We need a freezer. Like, very quickly. Uh, where can I get one? Where can I get one? It's probably going to be the gas station, isn't it? We're going to have to come the whole way up here. Oh, man. Such a long way to go. Alright, let's get this car sorted. Oh, the hood's badly damaged as well, isn't it? Either way, we're just going to have to go. We're going to have to pick it up with our bare hands. Carry it the whole way down here. Otherwise, we're going to be potato-less. I'm not ready to be a potato-less man. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Okay, it's the moment of truth. I think this is the right place. Or is it next door? Yeah, it's the right place. But, is there a freezer? Ah, it's not. Damn it. 
the only place I could think of that might might have one. That's not good. That's not good at all. Um, maybe we go check out the neighbours. Don't think the rusty rifle's got one. It's definitely got some bits around it, but don't think there's a freezer. My only other thought is the gas station in the centre of town. Very risky. We're not really um not really well equipped to go there. But it might be worth an attempt. Especially for that freezer. And if not. There is a town just up from us. They could have one. So there's, there's not a lot there. I think there's like a couple of warehouses and a food store. Some bits like that. Might be some extras. I'm not 100% sure. But I reckon that place could be a contender. I mean, if we can take a fridge in here, result. But I'm not very convinced. So I think we need like an electrical two. We're about to find out. Ah oh, no. Banging. Alright. Come on in. The water's fine. See ya. Alright, we can do this. We can actually do this. Let's get all twelve of those eggs out of there. I'm actually quite jealous. Those eggs would have been amazing. And it's way too heavy for us. Okay, let's go unload everything and come back. Okay, I think the easiest way to do this is just to quite simply move my entire inventory over onto the passenger seat. Hey, there we go. Just under. I'm not going to bother turning the car off. I just want to get in, grab this puppy and get out of here. Oh, what a beautiful sight. What a beautiful sight indeed. Let's head home. We've got some potatoes to wait for. <laughs> so that's still not quite seed bearing, but I mean, it's only a matter of time, right? But I think I might love you and leave you on this drive back. So I mean, we're only going to get home and place it anyway. So I'll just show you how wonderful it looks at the start of the next episode. But yeah, I'm going to love you and leave you just here. So thanks for watching. Massive thanks to members for supporting the channel. Like, subscribe if you enjoyed. Hopefully, stick around for the next one. Peace.